hey, I wanted to talk to you about this Sunday's worship at Galloway. I think by now you are aware that this Sunday, June the 21st, will be our first gathering for Sunday worship in the sanctuary in three months. And so it's a big day for us. One of the passages that's been pinging off of my mind is Psalm 122, verse 1. I was glad when they said unto me, let us go into the house of the Lord. It will indeed be good to be back with Galloway members worshiping and worshiping there in our sanctuary. We celebrate that. I think it's going to be very meaningful. At the same time, I want to say to you that if you have any concerns for your health, if you feel at any way at risk by being a part of such a gathering, please do not feel that you should come. We don't want anyone to come who feels that they are being put at risk by this. So if your age or your health conditions make you more vulnerable to the virus, or if you just feel that it's unwise to come and gather with a group of people at this stage, then by all means, do not come. We respect your precautionary uh, discretion. That's a good thing, and we want you to honor that. For those who are going to be joining us, I want to tell you a little bit about what it's going to be like. Yes, it is going to be wonderful to be back in the sanctuary with each other. Yes, it is going to be wonderful to sit under the preaching and teaching of the Word. Yes, it is going to be wonderful to worship together. And yes, we will feel the presence of the resurrected Jesus there with us. But we will need to do some things to keep ourselves safe and to take responsibility for ourselves and for each other. And so you need to understand that we will be masked. Everyone who takes part in this service will have to be masked. This is our way of showing love and care for each other. Likewise, we will not have the Lord's Supper. In the same way, we will not be able to uh, hug and shake hands and other ways that we are so accustomed to passing the peace among each other. But I think you understand the importance of that. Those things will return to our worship soon enough. But for the time being, it is good wisdom that we refrain from those things. There will be no Sunday school. There will be no gathering time afterwards for drinking coffee and sharing muffins. Those things, again, will have to come later. But there will be, there will be, the presence of the Lord Christ felt by the community in real worship. So, if you feel comfortable about joining us this Sunday, we will look forward to seeing you. Know that when you come, you will need to enter in through the Congress Street entrance to the sanctuary. If you cannot navigate the steps, we will work out for you to come through the courtyard and we will bring you into the sanctuary that way. Also, you need to be aware that when you come in, you will be asked if you've had any symptoms. Likewise, your temperature will be taken on your forehead with an infrared thermometer. And we'll ask you to write your name down. All of these are safety measures and all of these are precautionary acts that we are doing to take responsibility for ourselves as we choose to gather in worship. So you think about it. Talk with your friends and family about it. 
sit easy with yourself as you meditate on that. And if you decide to come, wonderful. If you decide that this time is not good for you and that you want to wait on that, that's wonderful too. There is no pressure. I'm Kerry Stockett, and I will look forward to seeing you at Galloway when you are ready.